Hi guys, how are you doing today? I am so excited to be filming this video because today I'm talking about my ColourPop liquid lipsticks and doing lip swatches on all of them. I have a lot of them, so I'm just super excited to be filming this and also a little scared because I feel like my lips are going to die after all these lip swatches. Um, I'm doing the lip swatches first and then if you keep watching I will have the review, um, some tips on how to wear them, some comparison between colors that you might think are similar and just tons of information so keep on watching. I am wearing Stingray right now which is their newest one. This is a collaboration with someone and um, she is very dark skinned and it looks completely different on me than it looks on her. On her it's a nude, it's absolutely gorgeous but if you can see on me it's a lot more vampy. I thought this would be really helpful for um, everyone out there who's super pale and wants to see how the ColourPop liquid lipsticks will look on them. So I guess if you want to see all that, then just keep watching. Searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come We must never stop the way yeah. Birds chirping and I hear my name Grasping into a life Life is happy but it's so insane We must merely make a start Savannah, I'm coming home Savannah, we'll never be alone Savannah, the beauty of the world Savannah, let's all take a road Savannah Stop the way, yeah. 
one off and just coat my lips in like six layers of chapstick because wow I have never um, lip swatched 18 liquid lipsticks in a row and my lips are numb so um, I figured I would just start out by talking a little about the old formula versus the new formula so um, the, the first two releases I believe are um, the older formula I don't know for sure I've never talked to the company never looked at all the ingredients and compared I just know from what it feels like on my lips it might feel different to you so you know go off of what you have but for example here I have MIDI and platform MIDI is um, kind of old in general as compared to all the other or the newest colors and platform just came out I definitely apply them differently and with different techniques so um, with MIDI, the old formula, I put on two layers of chapstick. Basically, like I coat my lips and I give them the extra hydration. So when I put MIDI on and it dries down, it doesn't dry down so dry that it flakes off like a lot of people have complained. If you have that problem, try putting on two layers of chapstick on before you apply the old formula and it does wonders it dries just the same except it doesn't dry with that flaky feeling it feels so comfortable on the lips it just feels really nice and I really enjoy the old formula actually more than the new one and um, I just really like that technique in using the chapstick I also use a lot of product I don't um, use one layer for the entire mouth I do the bottom with one and then I do the top with one that way I really coat it and it doesn't get splotchy and also as it's drying I try not to close my mouth it looks a little silly and I'm sure you've seen it in some of my other videos but I kind of just sit there and go and just let it <laughs> let it dry without closing my lips that way the um, inside doesn't kind of bunch together so for the new formula I do not put chapstick on because if you do put chapstick on first it will make it kind of sticky and it doesn't dry down completely which I don't enjoy so um, I go completely bare lipped I don't have any chapstick any moisturizer on it at all and I definitely try to apply less product if you have bigger lips than me you um, will probably need the two um, the one on top and one on bottom but if you have smaller lips than me, then definitely just use one pump to get the entire lips. I try to use one pump sometimes, so I have to go back with a little extra. Um, I feel like less is more with the new formula, and I still kind of leave my mouth open when I'm letting it dry. And um, yeah, that works pretty good for those. Not every new release I find is exactly the new formula. Like for me, um, what color was it that I put on? I can't. I think it was teeny tiny I put on and I forgot to do the chapstick and um, it dried down really dry and it felt like the old formula if I wasn't wearing chapstick. So I think that teeny tiny still requires chapstick. I will have every single one linked down in the description box and I will mark it with either if I believe it's old formula or new formula. I mean, don't like, you know, go crying to color pop and say, this girl said that it's a new formula because I don't know. It's just based off of my own, you know, um, experiences. So that's what it's based off of. Um, I know that there's quite a few colors that online you might think that they look the same. So I want to do swatches of those for you so you can see the differences between them. So I swatched all the comparisons. This is teeny tiny. Stingray, Tool, and Chili Chill, or maybe it's Chili Chili, I can't remember. And this one is Avenue, and then it's Silhouette. So these two are definitely different enough. You could definitely use both. Do like a really subtle ombre with Avenue on the outside and Silhouette in the middle would be so pretty. I feel like Teeny Tiny and Chili Chili are so <laughs> similar. I did not realize that they would be that close. Um, Stingray is also pretty close, but just a 
tiny bit lighter a little more subtle not as vampy as the other two but yeah so there are the comparisons for you i really wanted to do that and swatch them all beside each other So that is everything for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something or um, found some colors you want to try out. And I hope you guys just have a wonderful rest of your day. If you haven't subscribed already, please click subscribe. I would love to have you. And I'll see you all in my next video. So I just threw on midi because I'm about to go out and realized I forgot to say that the end swatches about the dark colors. Um, they were a little patchy, a little streaky, they were not the best swatches ever, but I want you to remember that I just put on 15 different liquid lipsticks and took off 15 different liquid lipsticks and they were applying a little funnier than usual because my lips were so dry and so like, you know, numb and tired of, um, you know, being used. So I just wanted to throw that out there that if you guys are interested in any of those colors that they normally apply beautifully. Um, the only one that doesn't always apply the best is Zipper, which is that bright purple, but the rest you are totally good. So um, goodbye for real this time. <laughs>